This is the first of several videos on doing conversions. We might call these quitting not allowed, figure it out conversions. Sometimes you are going to have to do some conversions and you're not going to necessarily know how to do it. So you just got to go in there and start working it. And we'll show you how to do that here in a couple example problems. If it's an assessment, any screwball conversions that you might need, I would give to you. But basic SI conversions, you need to be able to do those on your own. So let's try this problem here. Historically, hydraulic engineers in the U.S. have used the acre foot as a unit of water volume. An acre foot is the volume of water covering one acre of area to a depth of one foot. If a storm dumps two and a half inches of rain on a 150 acre field in 45 minutes, how many acre feet of water fell on the field? All right, so an acre foot is a unit of volume. An acre is 43,560 square feet, which it says there at the top of the screen. Although some of us just knew that. If all of your ancestors were farmers, as mine were, it was pretty much just expected that you knew that an acre was 43,560 square feet. And if you didn't, then you were sent to your room without supper. So you learned pretty quickly that an acre was 43,560 square feet, which is roughly a square. If you cut it into a square, it's about 200 feet square. And then here's a height of one foot. It's actually closer to 209 feet. It's just a hair short of that. But basically, that's an acre foot right there. 209 feet roughly by 209 feet by one foot deep. That is an acre foot. And we want to know how many of those fell on this field. You know what? I don't know. Let's just start here. X acre feet. Well, what are we given? We're given two and a half inches. Now, two and a half inches is a unit of length, just like feet is. And feet needs to be in the numerator of our answer. So I think two and a half inches, I think that looks good. And you know what? Let's convert that into feet right now. I suppose you could look this up, but honestly, I hope you know that there are 12 inches in one foot. And this is the abbreviation for inches. It's quotation marks and the abbreviation for foot is a single quotation mark. The way you can remember that is the word foot has one syllable and the word inches has two syllables. So that might be a way to remember. All right. So we have the feet part taken care of in our answer. Acre feet. This will give us feet because the inches will cancel. And so it looks according to our units that we need to take the number of feet and multiply by the number of acres. So let's do that. How many acres? 150, we're told. 150 acres. Those inches units will cancel like that. And this will give us acre feet. I don't even think we need this 45 minutes. That's not part of the question. The question is how many acre feet of water fell. The fact that it took place in 45 minutes of time isn't relevant to the question. We just want to know how many acre feet of water. So we're going to go 2.5 divided by 12 times 150. And let's do significant figures now. This 2.5 has two significant figures. The 150 has two significant figures. Who cares about the 45 because we didn't use that, although it does have two also. So we want to round our answer to two significant figures. What I got was 31 acre feet. So on some conversions, you just got to get in there and work it. Look at the units. Make sure they're in the numerator or denominator as appropriate. Convert them as you can and just kind of follow your nose. We're going to do a couple more videos that have some more examples with this.